G'day, it's Greg at Worldwide Salon Marketing. When the coronavirus is over, when we can all open our doors, you're going to be, uh, need to be ready for that. And uh, so on Monday, join me and one of Australia's most awarded salon and spa owners, Karen Briffer, with her take on what's going to need to be done to get you uh, back in business and customers coming back in uh, the door. Welcome to the call, Karen. Uh, hi, Greg. Thanks for asking me to attend. What are we going to go through on Monday? All right. So on Monday, we're going to be looking, um, we put procedures in place quite quickly um, when we were going through the process at the beginning, noticing that people really were looking for being and feeling safe in your, in your environment. So the number one thing for me is that I needed to communicate with our clients all the procedures that we already did. We did a lot of these things already, but we never told our clients that we were doing them. We just always have done them. So now we need to really start communicating a lot of the procedures that we, and we upped it um, in some areas that really needed to be a little bit more attentive um, because of the coronavirus, um, something that you probably wouldn't have had to have been so as pedantic about um, in the past, but with this being so infectious, we needed people to know that we were put things in place to make sure that they were safe. There was other forms that we put in place for our clients to fill out. Um, we also did a lot of other little bits and pieces so that when they first came into the business, um, they felt comfortable. But the biggest thing was actually sharing that with them. We needed to make sure that we were letting them know. Okay, in Monday's uh, live uh, webinar call, we're going to go through all of those point by point. Absolutely. So it's really important um, because the club, when we go back, coronavirus is not going to be gone um, and people are still going to be extremely wary. And so it's really important that we now spend some time in our businesses, making sure that every room, every area, reception is all geared up and kitted up and our staff are on the right page, um, that they know what is expected of them. There's no point in saying to them in the morning when they walk in, oh, by the way, you've got to do this, this and this, um, and then getting up them because they didn't do it. It's got to be really strict. It's got to be formal. It's got to be written down. They need to know exactly what's expected of them. It needs to be taught. It needs to, you need to have a formal meeting with it. So that's all the things that, in, that you would go through in that meeting and the things that we'll go through on Monday. Great. And we'll, uh, we'll go through that point by point in the live uh, video call on Monday. Look forward to that. See you then, Karen. Great. Thanks, Greg. See you then.